and we are about to kick off fight number eight. Okay, both fighters touch gloves. Nice take down there by James. They bring him straight back up, but good scramble. Kind of work to full guard. He needs to be careful there. If Ibrahim can push that arm away and lock up that triangle, that's not going to be a good position for, for James. It was great to see Ibrahim being active from the bottom, and James trying to pass, which he's doing the right thing. He's trying to break guard. Physically, James looks like the thicker and bigger opponent. That's it, pause, pause. Tell you what, Ibrahim does a great job of recovering guard again. Let him open his guard. Let him open his guard. Don't force it. Pause. James needs to be careful, he keeps extending that left hand back to try and pin the leg but he's at risk of getting triangled with his other opposite arm and head locked in. Good job of working to half guard there, he's advancing position, let's see if he can keep it. Nice. James moves to mount, pepper in the body, and Ibrahim's trying to work out. Yeah, James seems very heavy on top. I think Ibrahim's going to have to work his way out technically rather than trying to power his way out. It looks like he's setting up a, a sweep here. He's got the, right, the left side locked up, left foot and left arm. James doing a good job of keeping his weight down. See, Hold him down, push with the other hand. You're in control, James. Hold him down, push with the right, 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 push with yeah, he needs to, he needs to shift his weight. That bridge, like, that's what happens. Again, great work there by Bro. He powered his way out, exploded. James working the take down again, got it so easily. Straight back into mount. And we've kind of reset in the same position, but more in the middle of the mat. With only 10 seconds left in the round. So Ibrahim has definitely taken instructions from his corner team there. Round two, you ready? Let's go. Take it to him, come on. Let's go, let's go. Second round. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Again, both, strike, both fighters striking. Ibrahim looking for that takedown. He's waiting for that leg to come up. Accidental headshot there from James. Low calf kick there from Ibrahim. Again, Ibrahim's trying to go for that takedown, but James has spun around nicely, stayed in control. I feel like James is quite heavy and quite strong um, in comparison to Ibrahim here, even though they are fighting in the same way. Seems like James has some physical advantages that are wearing on Ibrahim a little bit. Ibrahim needs to be careful because he's going to leave the arm there, <coughs> expose him to the head and arm, but he does have half guard, so I don't know how effective it will be. And as you can see that, like James, you know, he knows what he's trying to do there, but Ibrahim is a slippery customer. I tell you, escape there nicely, only been taken straight back down again by James. Again, Ibrahim taking instruction from his corner, very present-minded. I don't actually think people appreciate how difficult it is to take instruction and then act on it in the, in the middle of the fight. Listen, it's a skill itself, you know, in itself, especially when you're amateur level fighting, you know, on a platform like this. You know, it's different to your gym environment where it's, it's an upgrade from sparring, but 
just the atmosphere will take it out of people. And to be able to listen to your cornerman and act, that, that's, you know, that says a lot. Lovely sweep from Ibrahim. Also McGray. sweep the hit by Ibrahim. Can he keep the back, but he's over the arm He's working for the arm bar. Maybe not. Great scramble there I by I think he James. got a little bit overzealous there and jumped on the back too, too quickly. He needed to be closer to the hips and kind of maintain that position, but he's just slid off. The referee re-centers them. Let's see what open guard game Ibrahim can play. I think from that position, keeping the butterfly hooks would have been a better option. I think what happens is... If you, the more inexperienced you are, butterfly hooks aren't really an option because it's, it's the element of like the person passing and it's the inexperience mm. they have uh, where they don't feel in control in butterfly hooks, but in full guard they feel more control. Yeah. So we're coming up towards the end of round two and James Ojidu back in control. Oh, I think James has taken this. So we have three more minutes. Both fighters retired. You know. Again, Ibrahim not setting anything up and going straight for that leg, but it was James could see that a mile and that could again, you know, he's not he's not setting his takedown with shots. He's in on the single there. Can he use it? Yeah, I mean, Ibrahim looks tired, you know, there's no energy coming from those shots. It's just straight for the takedown. The breathing is a little bit laboured for, for both athletes to slow down, but it's quite natural with the bigger guys. Some big shots there. I think he's more exhaustion more than anything with Ibrahim. <coughs> that triangle locked up. Yeah, he's actually locked up that triangle. James had to be careful of that. Can he posture out of it? He's going for the arm. James is holding on. The triangle's there. If he can pull the head down and just his hips up higher up. But he hasn't got the angle. Uh, he's got the triangle kind of locked on in very early stages, but uh, there's no squeeze from that position there. I mean, you can still work the arm for the arm bar from here. James did a good job there of like powering through, breaking through the guard, or lowering the guard to say. It is quite difficult to keep your hips up in that position for a long, long period of time, especially when you have someone trying to weigh down on you. So. Third round in, Ibrahim is a little bit tired, so he couldn't continue committing to that. But he's well, tell you what, something his again. hips are quite good because he's getting them right up there. One more sweep. One more sweep for everybody. Come on, James. Last bit. Push hard. Work hard. Work hard. Yeah, yeah. lovely, James. That's it. It's all you now. That's it. Stand. Go Man up. Come on, Ibrahim. Let's push up now, James. Come on. Push up, James. Push up. Take him to your left. Take him to your left. Take him to your left. It's not really much coming back there from Ibrahim now. James is doing the right thing, staying heavy, clocking the, you know, ticking the clock down. There we have it, another Helps bout. his opponent up. Completed there in this 84 kilo middleweight bout.
unanimous decision record. There you have it. <coughs> the winner declared James Odiju of the Apex Army in Windsor takes this bout.